So you have found a house you love and you want to make an offer. When offering, consider these factors to ensure you make a well-informed and competitive offer. Here are five things to keep in mind. Number one, market conditions. Understand the current state of the real estate market in the area where the house is located. Is it a buyer's market or a seller's market? In a seller's market where demand exceeds supply, you may need to offer more aggressively to compete with other buyers. In a buyer's market, there may be more negotiating power and you have more room to make a lower offer. Number two, research recent comparable sales in the area of similar properties in the neighborhood to determine the fair market value of the house you're interested in. Look at the factors such as size, condition, location, and amenities to find comparable properties and use this information to guide your offer and ensure it aligns with the market value. Number three, know your budget and financing. Determine how much you can afford to spend on the house and factor in additional costs, such as closing costs, property taxes, and potential repairs or renos. Get pre-approved for a mortgage before you make the offer. And this shows the sellers that you are a serious buyer and you have the financial capability to follow through with your purchase. Knowing your budget will help you make a realistic offer that you can comfortably afford. Number four, seller motivation. Try to gather information about the seller's situation and motivation for selling the property. Are they in a hurry to sell? Are there any specific terms or conditions that are important to them? Understanding the seller's perspective can help you tailor your offer to meet their needs and like and increase your likeliness of acceptance. Number five, conditions in your offer. Consider including conditions in your offer to protect yourself, such as a home inspection or financing condition. But this depends if we are in a buyer's or seller's market and if you will be competing. Additionally, be clear about any terms or conditions you're requesting, such as a flexible closing date or inclusion of certain appliances or furniture. Keep in mind that including too many conditions or demanding terms may weaken your offer, especially in a competitive market. Don't forget the letter to the homeowners. I have had many buyers win multiple offer situations because they included a letter and the seller connected with who they were. By carefully considering these factors, you can make a strong and well-informed offer on a house that increases your chance of success while also ensuring the terms are favorable to you as a buyer.